हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू सोनिया यस वी आर हैविंग द टॉपिक वाइज डिस्कशन ऑफ प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चंस ऑफ सी सेट दैट इज पेपर टू ऑफ सी एस सी फिल्म सो टुडे वी आर टेकिंग अप द टॉपिक ऑफ नॉन वर्बल रीजनिंग टिल नाउ वॉट एवर वी हैव कवर्ड इज कॉल्ड वर्बल रीजनिंग वाई बिकॉज वॉट एवर द इंस्ट्रक्शन वर गिवेन they were given in some word form or paragraph that is it is given in a written format <clears throat> but in the non verbal reasoning they generally give you figures pictorial representation then they, they might ask you they may give you four figures and then they might then they may ask you what would be the fifth figure what would be in the place of you know blank figure something like that so there will be some patterns in the figures and then you need to find it out also from the importance point of view of this topic this is an important topic because you can expect at least two to three questions from this topic every year that is what makes this topic very important first because this is not a very difficult topic this comes under moderate difficulty level moderate or easy that is the first thing and second every year minimum one to maximum three questions they can ask also this topic does not need any formula or method in one or two questions i might tell you one form uh, some formulas but even if you don't know the formula just by you know just general application of your mind that you will be able to solve the question so isme formula bhi nahi yaad karna hai method bhi nahi hai aisa koi bas the do teen bar practice chahiye and then once you will be you know try to solve the, uh, once you will be trying to solve the question on your own hai na by your practice to intuition se ye question solve ho jate hain automatically sir has already covered this topic in his lecture so you can access this video from this my subscription section under logical reasoning you can get this this is not verbal this is non verbal reasoning here you can get the sir's video and then you come to my video and i have covered all the questions from the year 2022 to 2011 before starting the topic in very short i want to tell you some basics that we will need to be understood we need to understand what are some of the basics hai na jo is chapter ke liye hame is topic ke liye aane chahiye okay so the first thing is this is the topic of non verbal reasoning first thing i already told you in the topic of directions routes and network again i want to tell you the directions so obviously this is east this would be west this is north this is south all these angles are 90 degree hai na so if i want to get the angle of north east so north and east so this 45 degree pe this would also be 45 this would be north east this north west this would be north west south east and this would be south west this is the direction east west east west north south north east north west south west south east then clockwise acha ghadi if this is your clock this is your watch to kaise watch kaise karti hai aise chalti hai in this direction so this is the direction of clockwise and what is anti clockwise if this this is the direction opposite to your watch's direction this would be anti clockwise
So these are some of the directions basics. Now there are two important concepts. One is mirror image and another is water image. So I have seen students कि mirror image में क्या करते हैं मान लो किसी चीज की image चाहिए तो then ये they you know start imagining कि if something is will be like this if something is given इसका mirror image पता करना then they try to rotate and then they do so many kinds of you know <coughs> manipulation from their side then they try to imagine कि ऐसे करना वैसे करना yeah that is a good good way imagination is a very good thing but if some other easier alternative is available then why should we go to the complicated side complication mein kyo jana hai our aim is to solve the question and that question can be solved very easily by just a simple logic imagination is necessary in some cases but in most of the cases you need not to do that kind of complex imagination that would take a lot of time and there might be a case that you may even not reach up to the final result. Isliye, I would tell you a very simple thing. Kaise aap mirror image ko pata kar sakte ho? Okay. Let's say there is some figure given. Something like this. Aur bol raha hai, bhai iska mirror image batao kya hai? Iska mirror image kya hai? What is mirror image? Ki agar maine yaap ek mirror rakh diya, तो उस मिरर में मुझे कैसी इमेज दिखाई देगी राइट अब मिरर इमेज निकालने के लिए क्या करते हैं या तो मैं इमेजिन करूं कि ये ऐसे जनरली कैसे होगा इफ दिस इज द फिगर ऐसे टर्न होके जाएगा ये पलट के जाएगा है ना सो आइदर मैं वो इमेजिनेशन करके करूं ये सिंपल है मैं यहां पे इमेजिन करूं यहां पे मिरर है है ना इफ दिस इज द मिरर देन मैं क्या करता हूं स्ट्रेट लाइन आई वॉन्ट टू ड्रॉ दिस इज द स्ट्रेट लाइन तो क्या करते बी ओनली टेक वन थिंग इन कीप ओनली थिंग वन इन आर माइंड दैट इज डिस्टेंस यू नीड टू फोकस अपॉन डिस्टेंसेस ओनली अगर डिस्टेंसेस पे आपने ध्यान दिया देन यू विल बी एबल टू मेक द मिरर इमेजेस वेरी इजीली कैसे लेट्स से दिस इज द पॉइंट सो ट्राई टू फाइंड the major corner points this is one point this is one point this is one point and this might be one point so now whatever distance will be of these points from this mirror the same distance will be of mirror image of the same points so if this would be same so the same length here it would be some dot same so this line will be draw drawn will be drawn like this ye thoda sa distance kam hai this and this okay so this is the like like this now this line is this now this distance this point is at this distance from this point this is the this this point we are getting ye point hamara ye wala point pahunch chuka hai is point se itni distance pe ye hai let's say this is the point this is the point so i'll draw this line so this line if this is a this is b then this would be a dash this would be b dash if this is c d e this would be c dash bc b dash c dash same इस पॉइंट का डिस्टेंस यहां से इतना ज्यादा है सेम डिस्टेंस नाउ दिस ई पॉइंट इज फर्दर सम डिस्टेंस अवे फ्रॉम सी सो सी डैश से सम डिस्टेंस पे यहां पे हो जाएगा ई डैश ई इज दैट मच डिस्टेंस सेम डिस्टेंस वुड बी हियर एंड डी इज सम व्हाट दिस डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम ए पॉइंट सो इफ दिस वुड बी दैट अगेन स्ट्रेट लाइन एंड इट वुड बी समवेयर लाइक दिस एट द सेम हाइट same height and this would be d dash and I'll, if i'll just draw like this 
that's that would be our mirror image did you get the point kya kiya aapne kewal aapne this is d dash c dash e ka e dash b dash a dash this is the mirror image of given figure so how easily we drew the mirror image very easy bas distance ko aapko dhyan mein rakhna hai we will try some more figures let's say we need to draw mirror image for this let's say this is kaise hoga so what i told ask you first mark the are borders like this let's say name i'll do the naming a b c d the distance of if this is the mirror this distance is a the same would be the distance e so this is nearer this is e dash then a is far let's say this is a dash you can see a dash a e is a line then i'll draw this directly then a dash e dash would be a line c is somewhat this distance so again i'll move it forward this would be c dash d is that much distance from mirror so i will draw something like this is d dash now a and d is also a line then a dash d dash would also be a line and b is that much distance from this mirror this is b dash c dash b dash and then bc is also a line then c dash b dash would also be a line so this would be mirror image of this figure you you can find this is this is a distorted figure ye zyada chauda ho gaya but nevertheless this is the concept of making the mirror image ठीक है नाउ आई वुड ट्राई आई वुड लाइक टू टेल यू अबाउट द वॉटर इमेज कि वॉट इज वॉटर इमेज वॉटर इमेज क्या होता है वॉटर इमेज इज ऑल्सो लाइक मिरर इमेज वॉटर इमेज इज ऑल्सो लाइक मिरर इमेज बस उसमें क्या है इसमें मिरर मैंने साइड में लगाया उसमें मिरर नीचे लगा दो लेट से दिस इज द फिगर something like this and i need to find the water image of this so if i wanted to find mirror image then i would have placed the mirror here but now i need to find water image so i would place the mirror below this and now we'll do the same thing of distance wala i would take the corner okay and here there is a symbol cross is given in the question this is a b c d now i what i'll do i'll just make a straight line this distance is a same distance a dash same distance b dash and this b c b c further this distance b c c dash now if we see ab is a line then a dash b dash is a line bc is a line then b dash c dash is a line now after c there is this much distance is d d is that much distance is d so yahan se bhi agar main itna hi distance le lu something like that this would be my d dash so cd is a line then c dash would be c dash d dash would also be line and there is a cross at d so i will mark this cross here so this is the water image of this given figure till now there is any doubt no so this is the concept of mirror image and water image i don't think there is any doubt there should be any doubt in these figures i just asked you to find the corners first name them and then you do the distances now let's say i want to find
let's say I want to find the mirror image of n, for example, n. n का मुझे mirror image पता करना है and water image पता करना है. So what will would be the mirror image? So for mirror image, what I will do? I will write like this and I will mark this mirror. I will name the corners A, B, C and D. I what I will do? I will just take these distances. Same distance. So I will draw this line. This would be C dash. This would be D dash. This way. Now I would mark another line of at such distance that this is A dash. This is B dash. Now you can find AD is a line. AD is a line. Then definitely A dash D dash would also be a line. So this is the mirror image. What we are getting of n. This is the mirror image of n. Let's say I want the I want to find out the water image of n. So this is n here. What I will do? Again I will name it A B C D. This is one point. So same distance water image. I'll place the mirror below. This is point B. This is point A. A dash, B dash. Similarly, this would be this distance is D, D dash, and this much distance is C. This is C dash. AD is a line, then definitely A dash D dash is also a line. So this is the water image of N. So now you can see that the mirror image of N and water image of N is looking like they are similar figures. Even though naming naming is changed, you know, but figure is similar if you look. If I want to make the mirror image of D, D, D ka mirror image. So what I will do? A, B, and is called come and C kar liya. So this is A dash, this is B dash and C dash is distance from here which is less. Let's say ye hai. So uh, now A, C, B is an arc. So A dash, C dash, B dash will also be an arc. So this is the mirror image of D. Got it? And now if I want to draw water image of D, then this is D water image again this is a this is b this point is c i'll do the same thing this is b dash this is a dash at c distance is somewhere in between if this is c here it would be somewhere c dash now acb is an arc then A dash, C dash, B dash would also be an R. Here you can see this is the water image of D. Now you can see the water image of D and actual image of D are same. But the mirror image of D and the actual image of D is different. So you need not to remember anything. You just need to know the concept. Ki how I made the water image and mirror image using the distances concept. Okay. So this was these were two basic concepts were very important concepts of mirror image and water image in this non-verbal reasoning. Now I would like to start the first question of our today's lecture. So this question has been asked in the year 2022. Consider the following statements in respect of a rectangular sheet of length 20 centimeter and breadth 38 centimeter. So they have given you one statement. Now they are asking, it is possible to cut the sheet exactly into four square sheets. And another is, it is possible to cut the sheet into 10 triangular sheets of equal area. Which of the above statements is are correct? ठीक. So rectangular sheet hai. So I draw kar or rectangular sheet. जो जो बोल रहा है बस करते जाना है कुछ रुकना नहीं है एक भी सेकंड के लिए ओके दिस इज रेक्टेंगुलर शीट दिस लेंथ इज 20 दिस लेंथ इज 8 
ठीक है नाउ इट इज आस्किंग इट इज पॉसिबल टू द कट द शीट एग्जैक्टली इन टू फोर स्क्वायर शीट नाउ यू नीड टू लुक वेरी केयरफुली वॉट दे हैव गिवेन यू इन द स्टेटमेंट इन टू फोर स्क्वायर शीट दे हैव नॉट मेन्शन दट फोर स्क्वायर शीट्स ऑफ इक्वल साइज और फोर इक्वल स्क्वायर शीट्स दैट मीन्स वॉट एवर द फोर स्क्वायर शीट्स आर देयर दे माइट बी हैविंग डिफरेंट डिफरेंट लेंथ डिफरेंट डिफरेंट एजेस है ना कोई फोर सेंटीमीटर का है कोई एट सेंटीमीटर का है कोई सिक्स सेंटीमीटर का है बट दिस शुड बी अस्क्वायर ऐसा नहीं है कि चारों सेम साइज के ही होने चाहिए दिस इज नॉट द केस नाउ चार स्क्वायर शीट बनानी है कैसे बनाए अच्छा दिस इज एट तो फॉर अ स्क्वायर शीट इफ दिस बेट इज एट दिन लेंथ शुड ऑल्सो भी एट तो लेट्स डिवाइड दिस लेंथ इन टू एट के पार्ट में लेट्स से दिस इज एट This also is it. Just a second, थोड़ा सा गड़बड़ हो गया okay now i would like to draw this 8 this is 20 this would be 8 this would be 8 so this is 8 this is 8 then this would be remaining 4 right so if i make this line okay so this is not straight okay so this length is 8 this length is also 8 so this is a square square number 1 this is also a square square number 2 theek hai to 8 8 ke do square to mil gaye mujhe ab is it possible to get two more squares so this length is 8 this is 4 to agar is 8 ko hum 4 4 mein bifurcate kar dein let's say this length is isko main aise match kar le this is 4 this is 4 and this length is 4 then this is 4 so this these two are also squares 1 2 this is square number 3 and this is square number 4 so did we get four squares yes we have these four squares with me right so this statement is correct so how would you approach you want to know, get the four square sheets this breadth is 8 so my 8 into 8 ke different squares pehle pata kar leta hu fir whatever length is given then I see further, is there a possibility to get two more squares? Four was length, breadth was eight. Then this time, I have breadth ko length and equal to two squares. Is there any doubt in this? Is there anything Okay, then the next option is, it is possible to cut the sheet into ten triangular sheets of equal area. Okay, so again I will make this like this. This whole length is 20. This length is 8. Now it they are giving 10 triangular sheets of equal area. That means every triangle which will be forming shall be having equal area. It should not be the case that you have 10 triangles mil gaye, but the area is different of each triangle from one another. This is not the case, they should be of equal area so now how will you do it triangle kya hota hai? let's say if there is a square this square hai isko maine diagonal se bifurcate kar diya then there will be two triangle formed and the area of these two will be equal because all the lengths are same so area would be half this length into this length and all the lengths are equal so the area of these two triangles will be equal so how a triangle gets formed if there is a square and if you make the diagonal, then this diagonal will bifurcate these two triangles, right? And these two triangles will be having equal area. So, if there are 10 triangular sheets, so that means if we get 5 squares of equal area, then we can easily get 10 triangular 
sheets of equal area. So five squares from this figure, how can we get five squares? Five can we get? Five squares or rectangles? Be agar ho. If this is the rectangle, these two triangles will also be of equal area because half this length into this length here also length n into this length. So obviously, if there is a square or triangle, and if we make the diagonal, then this di by diagonal will make two triangles which will be having equal area. So even if we we may get triangle or square, acha. Square, so we cannot get five squares. We cannot get, है ना? So we may get five rectangle. Five squares, why may uh, we will not get? Because अगर मैं twenty को five से divide करूँ, four 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 centimeter के five length मिल जाएंगी. But this breadth is eight. So this would be four into eight. For a square, length and breadth should be equal, which is not the in the, not the case. So what I will do? Four. Four, four, four. This, 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 this. These all are equal. You can, you may see that this is small, this is big, but these all are equal. So these are five rectangles. Five rectangles. So five to ten triangle. How will we get? I have mixed diagonal. Now you can see every. triangle has equal area because this length and this height this length this height or breadth length breadth length breadth length breadth sab mein same hai to formula of triangle half length into breadth wo diya hua hai now this is triangle number 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 So you can see I am getting ten triangular sheets, and every triangle is having equal area. So that means our option two is also correct. So the correct option would be one only two only both one and two. That is option C. So this was the question asked in year twenty twenty two. Any doubt here? कुछ भी नहीं है इसमें. Let's move on to the next question. Okay. Images of the consonant of English alphabet are observed in a mirror. What is the number of images of these which do not look like their original shapes? Consonants क्या होते हैं? There are twenty six letters in which there are five vowels. That is A, E, I, O, U. Except these five letters from our alphabets, all are consonant consonants. So if I write the consonants, then B, C, D, F, G, H, J, K, L, M, N, T, Q, R, S, T, V, W, X, Y, Z. these are our consonants <clears throat> now it is asking what is the number of images which do not look like their original shapes number of images that is mirror image pata karni hai inme se kitne hain jinki mirror image unke same exactly original shape ke barabar nahi hoti hai so if we find ki kitne hain jinki mirror image resembles the original shape then if we will minus in vowel to khatam ho gaye So then means twenty one consonants available in twenty one. Me, if I minus those who resemble with their original shapes, then I will be getting the number, jinki original image se image match nahi karti hai. ठीक है? So let's say B. If this is B, you can see the mirror image will be like this. Here, here, it would be like this. So obviously B ka match. नहीं करता है तो दिस इज नॉट करेक्ट सी सी वुड बी लाइक समथिंग लाइक दैट सी भी नहीं करता है है ना डी डी वुड बी लाइक दिस एफ एफ वुड बी लाइक दिस 
तो जनरल ट्रेंड इज कि जिनके भी राइट यू नो राइट और लेफ्ट में किसी भी लेटर के अगर कुछ शेप बना हुआ है देन दैट विल नॉट मैच विद दर ओरिजिनल शेप जी एफ के राइट में लाइन्स है तो वो लेफ्ट में आ गई अब ये जी है तो जी का कुछ ऐसा कुछ करके बन जाएगा है ना राइट में उसके शेप बना हुआ है तो इफ यू सी एच एच इज सिमिलर लेट्स इफ दिस इज द लाइन एच इज सिमिलर ऑन बोथ रोड राइट एंड लेफ्ट सो इवन इफ यू विल मेक द मिरर इमेज ऑफ एच दिस विल बी सेम दिस लेंथ दिस लेंथ एंड दिस लेंथ दिस लेंथ this line this line so the mirror image of h would be yes that would resemble the original image to so b ka nahi match kar raha c ka nahi kar raha d ka nahi kar raha f ka nahi kar raha g ka nahi kar raha h ka kar raha hai now if i'll see j if j is the case this then ye aise aise ho jayega something like that k k bhi nahi hoga l like this to l bhi nahi hoga m so you can see m if you make this line This is similar on both right, right on left. आप बाइफरकेट अगर किसी को भी करके देख लो इफ इट इज इक्वल ऑन बोथ द साइड देन द ओरिजिनल इमेज विल भी सेम जी को आप बाइफरकेट करो नहीं हो रहा है एफ को करो नहीं हो रहा है डी को करो नहीं हो रहा है बट एम को करो तो हो रहा है दैट मीन्स ये ओरिजिनल इमेज से करेगा तो वन इज एच दैट इज एम एन का वी हैव ऑलरेडी सीन कि वो रिवर्स हो जाता है तो एन इज ऑल्सो नॉट देर पी इफ दिस इज द केस पी इज ऑल्सो नॉट देर क्यू बाइफरकेट करो देर इज समाइन हियर दिस इज ऑल्सो रॉन्ग R R is like this, so it would be like this. R is also wrong. S bifurcate करो नहीं होगा वो कुछ ऐसा कुछ करके होगा something like that. S भी नहीं होगा. Now if you see T, if this is T, you bifurcate T. It is similar on both right right and left. So T would also be same. T is correct. If you see U, if you bifurcate like this, so right and left are similar. So U का भी, if you make this underline, obviously U will be same. V, V is also similar. If you make this line, so distance या mirror image will be same. T का नहीं होगा. अच्छा U is obviously U is a vowel. So U तो वैसे भी count नहीं होगा. V is right, okay. W W ऐसे होता है so you can, if you bifurcate, both are same, so इसका mirror image भी like this होगा. X, if you bifurcate like this, mirror image would be same. And Y is like this, इसका mirror image भी Y ही होगा. And Z, Z ऐसा है, bifurcate करने पर same नहीं आ रहा है, वो कुछ ऐसा होगा. So Z is also wrong. So if we see, there are how many such letters whose mirror image is same to their original shape then we'll find out if i write h m v w x y and t is left sorry t is left h m t is also here t so 1 2 3 4 5 6 so these seven letters are there whose mirror image is same to their original shape seven consonants ka mirror image same hai 21 total consonant hai then how many consonants will be there whose mirror image will not be same to their original shape that is 21 minus 7 that is 14 so is there any option yes option b 14 is the correct option koi bhi doubt isme so this was the concept on mirror image that is why i told you this mirror image and water image concept is very important this gets repeated almost every year they ask at least one question from this concept aur yahan pe kuch difficult nahi tha aapko is distances pata honi chahiye and you can remember also this ki kitna kis kis ka mirror image and uh, original shape dono ka same rehta hai theek hai this may come handy when if they ask some similar kind of question in you know in your upcoming exams theek hai your next question 
This question was asked in the year 2020. What they are asking? The minimum number of points of intersection of a square and a circle is 2. The maximum number of points of intersection of a square and a circle is 8. Which of the following is still, the statements is correct? Minimum number of intersection of a square and a circle. Minimum number of intersection. Let's say this square is this circle. Hai. So yes, 2. Yes, 2 is correct. But if I make like this, there is no intersection point, zero intersection point, and it is said the minimum number is two. Look, wrong. Minimum number is zero. Minimum number is zero. Circle agar square ke andar ho jaye, to minimum number zero hai. Acha maximum number dekhe. Maximum kab ho sakta hai? Let's say there is a circle, and I make a square such that this har side do bar cut ho. Yes, let's say aise banaya maine. Yes, side cut hui. This side also has cut two times. S. Or the possibility in Yogi. Agar may essay banao or essay banadia. So only twice if essay. Essay the banagani. But still four if this is a square. So this is not right. So this is the case where maximum number of intersection points you will get. So how many intersection points are here? One. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Every side is cutting twice. Koi side could teen bar to nahi cut. If there is a line, how many times a circle can cut this line? Maximum two times. An arc can cut a line maximum at two points, not three points. So maximum two points for one side, in total four sides, then maximum four into two, that is eight points. So this is the figure which shows the maximum number of intersections between a square and a circle. So the correct option, so this option is correct. So the correct option would be option B that is 2 only. Quit out is me? Kuch bhi nahi hai. Ye concept aapko yada hai chahiye. Ki arc and line agar cut kar rahe hai, to maximum 2 intersection point can be there. Thik hai? So, ek line Ek arc ko do bar cut kar sakti, then four lines maximum, four into two, eight times cut kar sakti, and that's how the we get the answer. Okay. We'll move on to the next question. The number of parallelograms that can be formed from a set of four parallel lines intersecting another set of four parallel lines. So, bhai, maine aise banaya, ye. These are four parallel lines. These are also four parallel lines. Right? Now, what is a parallelogram? Parallelogram is like whose sides, opposite sides are equal and opposite sides are parallel also. Okay? So, this is parallel to this, this is parallel to this and these two will be equal, these two will be equal. Okay? So, this is a parallelogram. Now, I want to count how many numbers number of parallelograms being formed here. So let's say to single parallelogram banne, single single box se ban rahe Let's say single. Hume count karna hai, right? Single single wale. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So single parallelogram 9 ho rahe hai. Badiya. Now I want to calculate the number of parallelograms which are getting formed using two, you know, two boxes. Two boxes are made by two parallelograms, which are made by parallelogram, they are going to be removed from their number. So, how will we get? Two is made by two. This is one. If I just use this. One, two, three, Four, five, six. Six to ye hoge. Six. Kewal six hi hoge two se. Dimaag lagao. Okay. In these cases, you need to look for all the possibilities. Otherwise, you might miss some numbers or you may add some numbers, you know, twice or thrice. This is what dhyan se dekhna hai. Ab agar mein aise dekhu. 1, 2, 
थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सिक्स दैट इज ट्वेल्व सच पैलोग्राम्स आर देयर विच आर गेटिंग फॉर्म यूजिंग टू बॉक्सेस और टू पैलोग्राम्स कोई दिक्कत यहां तक नहीं अब मैं थ्री पैरोलोग्राम्स वाला पता करता हूं कि थ्री वाले कितने हैं थ्री वाले कितने हैं पैरोलोग्राम दिस इज वन टू थ्री राइट सो थ्री वाले ये हो गए एंड अगेन यू डू लाइक दिस वन टू That is six. So these are from single parallelogram, two parallelograms, three parallelograms. Now if I take four parallelograms, कि four से कितने बन रहे हैं? Four से कितने बन रहे हैं parallelogram? ये अब हमें देखना है. This is one, two. वन टू देन दिस इज थ्री एंड एंड दिस इज फोर फोर तो ये हो गए अच्छा अगर मैं ऐसे देखू दिस तो दिस इज ऑलरेडी बीन काउंटेड क्योंकि या तो ऐसे देखो या ऐसे देखो दिस इज द सेम पहले लोग दैट मीन्स लाइक दिस और लाइक दिस वी विल गेट ऑल द फोर पहले लोग सेम सो फोर वाले कितने हो गए फोर हो गए टोटल ठीक है अच्छा फोर के अलावा क्या पॉसिबल है फाइव तो पॉसिबल नहीं होगा वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव कैन नॉट बी अलोग्राम तो नेक्स्ट पॉसिबल होगा हमारा सिक्स वाला सिक्स वाला पॉसिबल होगा सिक्स वाले को जरा हम अच्छा येलो कलर से नोट करते हैं सो दिस इज वन टू and here it would be different three and then it would be four right so these would be four sixth wala seven se banega nahi eight se bhi nahi banega then nine se hi banega only possibility would be nine so nine wala kya ho jayega nine wala ho jayega this one एक ही है नाइन का तो एक ही पॉसिबिलिटी होगी वन और अगर मैं ऐसे भी देखो तो सेम है तो नाइन वाला इज ओनली वन तो इफ आई एड द नंबर टोटल नंबर ऑफ फेलोग्राम फॉर्म नाइन प्लस ट्वेल्व प्लस सिक्स प्लस फोर प्लस फोर प्लस वन दैट इज इक्वल टू थर्टी सिक्स इज एनी ऑप्शन थर्टी सिक्स यस ऑप्शन डी थर्टी सिक्स इज देयर सो दिस इज द मैथड ऑफ काउंटिंग The number of parallelograms or rectangles or triangles, number of figures, है ना? In a step by step approach. आप step by step approach करोगे, then you will be able to find the correct answer. Otherwise, आप कुछ figures उसमें से miss कर जाओगे. Thirty six का thirty two कर दोगे, twenty four कर दोगे, कुछ भी कर दोगे. आपको एक time के बाद मिलेंगे ही नहीं. और आप किसी को double count कर दोगे. So this is the systematic approach. Now, I want to tell you one formula for this. If exactly same question is given, exactly same question is given कि चार parallel line हैं, उनको intersect four parallel lines कर रही हैं, four parallel lines उनको three parallel lines intersect कर रही हैं, five parallel lines हैं, four parallel lines intersect कर रही हैं, something like that. And then they ask how many square or rectangles are getting formed, how many parallelograms are getting formed. Then there is a formula that after this intersection you count number of rows and number of columns we call this as m we call this as n the number of rows here is 1 2 3 number of rows number of columns is 1 2 3 columns then the number of parallelograms is equal to sigma of m into sigma of n. What is sigma of m? Sigma of m is it means three plus two plus one. 
तीन से आप ऐड करते चले जाओ वन तक थ्री प्लस टू प्लस वन अगर नंबर ऑफ रोज फाइव होता तो सिग्मा फोर सिग्मा फाइव क्या होता फाइव प्लस फोर प्लस थ्री प्लस टू प्लस वन सो थ्री प्लस टू प्लस वन दैट इज सिक्स फॉर सिग्मा एम यू डी सिग्मा एम इज इक्वल टू एम इन टू एम प्लस वन बाई टू दिस फॉर्मला एवरीबडी नोज है ना इफ एम इफ यू नो नीड टू गेट द सम फ्रॉम वन टू लेट से फोर वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव so 5 to 1 so n is 5 so if you want to get the sum starting from 5 to 1 5 4 3 2 1 in consecutive order starting from 1 to this number then the formula is n n plus 1 by 2 where n is this upper number 5 5 1 6 6 by 2 that is 15 5 per 4 9 12 14 15 that is correct so this is the formula of sigma m so here sigma m is equal to Six sigma n is also equal to because it is also three six. Then sigma m into sigma n six into six is equal to thirty six. This is one formula where you can directly get the result. But again, I would more emphasize on understanding rather than formula. But इसको आप पत याद कर लो कि अगर exactly ऐसे question आ जाते हैं तो आप directly apply कर सकते हो. ठीक है? There is one more formula which you can remember. to get the answer and that formula is that would be permutation combination wala to aap usko bhul jao ye formula aapke liye theek hai this is an easy formula to solve the questions theek hai so that is how we solve the questions like this where that counting is involved theek hai so we will move on to the next question okay so this is a three dimensional figure given this was asked in the year 2018 how many triangles does the above figure have to ab dekho isme triangles solid side se bhi bane hain dotted side se bhi bane hain and you can see dotted and solid dono se bane hain theek ab aap aise count karne jaoge to yaar bada difficult lag raha hai confusing sa bhi lag raha hai ki kya hai kaise karna hai so now what i will do मैं सिस्टमेटिक अप्रोच बनाने के लिए सिस्टमेटिक अप्रोच बनाने के लिए आई वुड काउंट द ट्रैंगल्स विद सॉलिड लाइंस मैं अलग अलग कर लेता हूं इससे ना रिपीटेशन नहीं होगा या कुछ छूटेगा नहीं ट्रैंगल्स विद डॉटेड लाइंस एंड ट्रैंगल्स विद both solid and dotted lines so now if i count the triangles with solid lines so this is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 Nine and one. This is ten. Did you get? How say? One, two. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and this is ten. डाउट इसमें आप भी देखो एक बार ध्यान से दिस इज वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन कोई दिक्कत इसमें फिर से देखो डॉटेड लाइन इफ दिस इज वन Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
this is 10. So these are 10 triangles with solid lines. <coughs> okay. Now I want to get the triangles which are made up of only dotted lines. So dotted lines let's say red le leta So dotted lines ke liye kon -kon se ho This would be one. One a dotted line. Hai. This would be another. Two. Ye dono dotted lines hi thi. Tabhi to red hai pe. That means three. And another triangle would be this four. Aur koi dotted lines hai? ये डॉटेड है पर ये नीचे डार्क हो गई सॉलिड लाइन हो गई डॉटेड है सो आई थिंक दिस फोर वन टू थ्री एंड दिस फोर फोर आर विद डॉटेड लाइंस फोर आर विद डॉटेड लाइंस नाउ आई वांट टू कैलकुलेट द नंबर ऑफ ट्रायंगल्स व्हिच आर मेड अप ऑफ बोथ सॉलिड एंड डॉटेड लाइंस बताओ कैसे होगा नाउ यू काउंट हाउ विल वी गेट द ट्रेंगल्स विथ बोथ सॉलिड एंड डॉटेड लाइंस आर यू गेटिंग हाउ विल वी गेट इट so if we see count from here this is solid this is dotted one not not this one sorry just a second just a second or if we see that green color one this would be one this is another two then is there any triangle okay this is one triangle P is this line. This triangle. This triangle. Okay. So these are four triangles. And any other possibility left here? If I can find some more triangles. Any possibility here? Any possibility here? Yes. If you can find this is one triangle which I can find here. So similarly, there will be one triangle <coughs> like this. This is so one, two, three, four, five, six. Any other possibility? So till now I have found six such triangles. Any other possibility here? So now I have found triangle with solid lines are ten, triangle with dotted lines are four. And triangle with uh, both solid and dotted lines are 6. And total triangles would be 10 plus 4 plus 6 is equal to 14 plus 6, 20. <coughs> the correct option would be option B, 20. Who your triangle is possible? No. So this was somewhat confusing question. This is why you have a systematic approach follow. Where I have bifurcated this triangle. So earlier what I have bifurcated? The, in number of boxes. One box, two box, three box, se kitne ban rahe hai, four, six, nine. Na? Yaha pe maine kaise bifurcate kiya? Solid se kitne ban rahe hai, dotted se kitne ban rahe hai, both se kitne ban rahe hai. And then I have added these triangles. Thik hai? To koi doubt yaha pe aapko? Nahi. So now we will move on to the next question. That is question number so in this question what they are asking it was asked in, in the year 2018 how many diagonals can be drawn by joining the vertices of an octagon how many diagonals can be drawn by joining the vertices of an octagon octagon kya hota hai? that is polygon who is having eight sides right Wow. This is straight line. Oh, 
ओके सो दिस इज एन ऑक्टागन विथ एट साइड वेरी नाइस अगर मैं इस एक वर्टिसेस वर्टेक्स को चुनू देन हाउ मेनी नंबर ऑफ डायगोनल्स कैन आई मेक सो आई कैन नॉट मेक डायगोनल विद द एडजेंट वर्टिस दैट इज आई कैन नॉट बिकॉज दिस विल बी एजेस दिस इफ आई इफ आई टेक दिस वर्टेक्स और दिस वर्टेक्स सो दिस टू विल बी लाइन्स और एजेस दिस विल नॉट बी डायगोनल्स सो वॉट विल बी द डायगोनल्स दिस विल बी अ डायगोनल दिस विल बी अ डायगोनल this will be a diagonal this will be a diagonal and this will be a diagonal so these five are the diagonals from one vertex from one vertex how many diagonals we are getting five then total how many diagonals are how many vertex are there 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 8 there are total eight vertex from one vertex we are getting five diagonals then from eight vertex how many diagonals will be there 40 that is there will be total 40 uh, 40 diagonals from all the vertices but you need to remember one thing ki yaar ye batao ek diagonal ko how many times we are adding if this diagonal 1 3 is from this vertex 1 and 3 but again when we are taking this vertex 3 then also we are drawing this diagonal then also we are counting this diagonal so each diagonal is getting counted two number of times isko maine do bar jod liya na one se bhi joda idhar se bhi joda so each diagonal should be counted only at once so her diagonal two times jod raha hai so there are total 40 diagonals that means each diagonal is getting counted a counted by two times so this would be half that is there will be 20 diagonals that is that are possible by joining the vertices of an octagon so option would be option a that is 20 right theek hai so this is a very systematic approach this is an analytical approach but there are some formulas are also given some formulas are also given for this kind of problems if it is asked ki bhai how many diagonals can be drawn by joining the vertices of a polygon if it is an octagon that is okay बट लेट से उन्होंने पॉलीगन दे दिया उन्होंने पेंटागन दे दिया ये लेट से पेंटागन है हाउ मेनी सच डायगनल्स आर पॉसिबल यूजिंग द गिवन वर्टिसेस देन देन देयर इज द फॉर्मूला एंड फॉर्मूला इज रिटर्न एज एन इनटू एन माइनस थ्री बाई टू दिस फॉर्मूला इज फॉर नंबर ऑफ डायगनल्स दैट कैन बी ड्रॉन बाई जॉइनिंग द वर्टिसेस ऑफ अ पॉलीगन ऑफ अ पॉलीगन इफ पॉलीगन इज एन ऑक्टागन दैट मीन्स एन इज इक्वल टू एट सो इफ यूल पुट हियर एट Into eight minus three by five by two, that is twenty. The same answer we are getting here. Pentagon is then n will be five five by two into five minus three two. That will be five such diagonals are possible. So this is one formula which you can remember. If this kind of question comes, you can directly use this formula. There is another formula which we generally write as n c two minus n. एन सी टू माइनस एन हाउ डज दिस फॉर्मूला कम इसका एक डेरिवेशन है वो आई डोंट थिंक यू विल बी नीडिंग राइट नाउ बट यू कैन ऑल्सो रिमेंबर दिस फॉर्मूला ऑल्सो वेयर वॉट इज एन सी टू देर इज अ फॉर्मूला फॉर एन सी आर दैट इज एन फैक्टोरियल अपॉन आर फैक्टोरियल एन माइनस आर फैक्टोरियल एवरीबडी नोज फैक्टोरियल इफ दिस इज आर फैक्टोरियल लेट्स थ्री फैक्टोरियल तो थ्री फैक्टोर मीन थ्री इंटू टू इंटू वन Four factorial means four into three into two into one, something like that. So n c two minus n, n c two minus n. Let's say, let's say n is eight for octagon. I'm telling, I'm calculating n is equal to eight. That is eight c two minus eight. Eight c two means eight factorial upon two factorial. Eight minus two factorial minus eight. So if I solve this. If I'll solve this, if I'll solve this, this would be eight factorial upon two factorial into six factorial minus eight 
तो एट फैक्टोरियल को वॉट आई कैन राइट एट इंटू सेवन इंटू सिक्स इंटू फाइव इंटू फोर इंटू थ्री इंटू टू इंटू वन दैट मीन्स इट कैन बी रिटर्न एज सिक्स फैक्टोरियल अपॉन टू फैक्टोरियल टू इंटू वन इंटू सिक्स फैक्टोरियल माइनस एट सिक्स फैक्टोरियल कट गया टू फोर ट्वेंटी एट माइनस एट दैट इज ट्वेंटी सो यू आर गेटिंग दिस आंसर ट्वेंटी अगेन सो करेक्ट ऑप्शन वुड बी ऑप्शन ट्वेंटी आंसर ट्वेंटी एंड यू कैन गेट द आंसर ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम थ्री डिफरेंट मेथड्स The first one is analytical. आप कैसे काउंट करते हो सेकेंड इज वेरी इजी एन एन टू एन माइनस थ्री बाई टू वाला फॉर्मुला था एंड थर्ड आई है परमोटेशन कॉम्बिनेशन वाला फॉर्मूला ठीक यू कैन रिमेंबर दीज टू फॉर्मूलाज एज वेल इफ सच काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन इज गेट बिग एस अगेन यू कैन डायरेक्टली यूज द फॉर्मूला ठीक है नाउ वी विल मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन देर आर 24 equally spaced points lying on the circumference of a circle. What is the maximum number of equilateral triangles that can be drawn by taking sets of three points as the vertices? What are you? A 24 is. This is a circle. If this is one, two, three. ठीक है ऐसा कुछ नंबरिंग कर रखा है एक सर्कल पे एंड दीज ऑल आर इक्वली स्पेस तो ऐसा नहीं देखना यहाँ पे स्पेस कम है यहाँ पे ज्यादा दीज ऑल आर इक्वली स्पेस वट इज द मैक्सिम नंबर ऑफ इक्वलेटर ट्रेंगल वट इज द इक्वलेटर ट्रेंगल इक्वलेटर ट्रेंगल इज समथिंग लाइक दैट इफ इन अ ट्रेंगल देर आर थ्री वर्टिस एंड ऑल साइड आर इक्वल इन अ ट्रेंगल देर आर थ्री वर्टिस तो फॉर एन इक्वलेटर ट्रेंगल हमें थ्री पॉइंट लेने एज वर्टिस इन्हीं पॉइंट में कोई थ्री वर्टिस लेने तो देर आर ट्वेंटी फोर पॉइंट उसमें थ्री पॉइंट हमने वर्टिस के लिए ले लिए तो देर आर ट्वेंटी वन पॉइंट रिमेनिंग एनी डाउट हियर कोई डाउट हियर इसमें नहीं ट्वेंटी वन पॉइंट रिमेनिंग अब बात यह है कि नाउ वी नीड टू फुलफिल द कंडीशन ऑफ द इक्विलेटरल ट्रेंगल कंडीशन क्या होती है कि द साइड ऑफ द इक्विलेटरल ट्रेंगल आर इक्वल साइड ऑफ द इक्विलेटरल ट्रेंगल आर इक्वल तो इफ देर आर ट्वेंटी वन पॉइंट एंड देर विल बी थ्री साइड दैट मीन्स सेवन सो देर विल बी द गैप ऑफ सेवन पॉइंट बिटवीन टू वर्टिस राइट सेवन 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 देन यू विल गेट ट्वेंटी वन सारे वर्टिस के बीच की लेंथ दैट वुड बी द साइड ऑफ द ट्रेंगल विल बी सेम सो इनके बीच में भी सेवन का स्पेस होगा इसमें भी सेवन का इसमें भी सेवन का स्पेस तो लेट से मैं मान लेता हूं कि आई एम टेकिंग वन एज वन वर्ट इज नाउ आई विल लीव सेवन पॉइंट बिटवीन दम एंड देन दैट द नेक्स्ट पॉइंट एर्थ पॉइंट वुड बी द नेक्स्ट वर्ट इज वर्ट एक्स सो वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन सो दिस पॉइंट विल बी द स्पेस सो दिस विल बी द नेक्स्ट वर्ट एक्स then again seven one two three four five six seven and then this will again be next vertex and this will be seven one two three four five six seven that means the gap or the distance between these vertices vertices are same seven points seven points seven points so now if i draw lines like this like this and this is a line then this is an equilateral triangle this is an equilateral triangle theek hai ab acha kar main agla equilateral triangle draw karu with keeping two as vertex then seven points 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 this will be the next point and here it would be this point so the next equilateral triangle will be by draw like this 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 is another equilateral triangle theek hai this is another 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 so if you see how many such equilateral triangles are possible 1 2 
वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट एंड नाइन्थ वाला इक्विलेटर ट्रेंगल यू कैन सी दिस वर्टेक्स इज ऑलरेडी बीन टेकन सो फ्रॉम हियर दिस इक्विलेटर ट्रेंगल्स विल स्टार्ट गेटिंग रिपीटेड फ्रॉम दिस एट पॉइंट दिस विल बी न्यू वर्टिस एंड फ्रॉम हियर इट सेल्फ नाइन टेन इलेवन ट्वेल्व इन दिस दिस विल बी द वर्टिसेज ऑफ ऑलरेडी यू नो ड्रॉन इक्विलेटर ट्रेंगल्स सो देयर विल बी एट सच इक्विलेटर ट्रेंगल्स वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट एनी एट पॉइंट आप ले सकते हो सो एट सच इक्विलेटर ट्रेंगल्स विल बी देयर जो कि देट कैन बी ड्रॉन बाई यूजिंग दीज थ्री पॉइंट एस वर्टिस ऑन द सर्कल सो द करेक्ट ऑप्शन वुड बी ऑप्शन सी दैट इज एट ठीक है कोई डाउट इसमें कोई डाउट नहीं है ठीक है नाउ वी विल मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन सो द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज बीइंग आस्ड इन द ईयर 2018 सो व्हाट दे आर आस्किंग कंसीडर द फिगर्स गिवन बिलो सो इट इज अ क्वेश्चन ऑफ नॉन वर्बल वर्बल रीजनिंग दैट मींस दे हैव गिवन यू दैट फिगर एंड नाउ दे आर आस्किंग यू दिस consider the figures given below and they are asking to fit the question mark the correct answer would be now if i see ki what is the pattern that is getting followed if i see isme main na isko body maan leta hu isko foot maan leta hu let's say ya legs maan leta hu to body and legs alag alag pattern bana rahe hain so if this is a this shape this shape then line and this opposite shape this shape line opposite shape here it is line then this shape then this matlab ab isko ye idhar this comes this side this comes this side this comes this opposite side now this comes here this comes here then definitely this must be coming here because this comes here this comes here then definitely this will be coming here so in the body side and body is having one square kind of thing that is shaded something like that aisa kuch shaded sa ban jayega theek hai theek now if i see the legs 2 3 4 2 3 4 4 4 2 3 4 2 now 3 ये तीन वाला आ गया तीन वाला आ गया इधर देन फोर वाला थ्री थ्री के बाद इधर फोर देन हियर इट वुड बी कमिंग टू सो दीज विल बी टू लेग्स सो एनी ऑप्शन टू लेग्स टू लेग्स लाइक दिस नॉट डॉट सर्कल दिस इज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन एंड आउट हियर कुछ भी नहीं है बॉडी और लेग दोनों आप दिख रहे हैं कि हाउ दिस इज मूविंग लाइक दिस like in this way this is getting here this is here this is here again this is here this is here this is here and legs me 2 3 4 then then this becomes first this came set this place 4 then this 2 then this 3 now again what will happen this 3 will come here this will come here and the remaining would be here like right read out here okay so next question in the figure 1 to 6 above some parts are shown to change their position 6 hai some parts are shown to change their position in regular directions following the same sequence of the following will appear at the seventh place acha this is the figure aur aapko na seventh place pe pata karna hai theek hai to main iska pattern dekhta hu Now, if I see this triangle, this triangle is here, then here, then here, then here, then here. That means triangle is following this anti-clockwise approach. So, if this is the circle, this is the line, this is the figure kind of. So, this triangle is following anti-clockwise approach here, then here, then here in this figure, then here in this figure, then here in this figure. then again it will be like this so triangle will be coming at this position okay very nice now if i see 
that rectangle or square whatever is there this is here then here that is it is following a clockwise approach so here here then here then here then here then here so again from here it will be going like this clockwise approach so triangle will be here so is there any diagram like this triangle should be at this position and this is so this is option d is correct option कोई डाउट इसमें कोई भी डाउट नहीं है सिंपल ठीक सो वी विल मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन देर आर फोर हॉरिजॉन्टल एंड फोर वर्टिकल लाइंस पैरल एंड इक्वी डिस्टेंट टू वन अनदर ऑन अ बोर्ड व्हाट इज द मैक्सिमम नंबर ऑफ रेक्टेंगल्स एंड स्क्वायर्स दैट कैन बी फॉर्म दिस इज अ सिमिलर क्वेश्चन वी हैव डन जस्ट नाउ फोर पैरल लाइन्स Two, three, four. Now you can count like this: one, 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 वाले, one, one box वाले, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, two box वाले, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, है ना? Did you get seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve? Then three boxes वाले, one, two, three. Four, five, six, four, one, two, three, four, six. वाले, one, two, three, four, and nine वाला one. Total thirty six. This we have done this question just now. So तुमने line में तिरछी कर दी थी parallelogram के लिए. Here these are parallel and it is making rectangles or squares. So that's why I have made the lines straight. Formula, formula. What I have told you. क्या formula बताया था मैंने इसका? इसको आप डायरेक्टली निकाल सकते थे द फॉर्मुला फॉर दिस वुड बी सिग्मा एम इंटू सिग्मा एन एम क्या है नंबर ऑफ रोज देर आर वन टू थ्री एम इज इक्वल टू थ्री नंबर ऑफ रोज एन इज इक्वल टू वन टू थ्री सिग्मा एम इज इक्वल टू एम थ्री प्लस टू प्लस वन दट इज सिक्स सिग्मा एन इज इक्वल टू थ्री प्लस टू प्लस वन दट इज सिक्स तो सिग्मा एम इंटू सिग्मा एन इज इक्वल टू सिक्स इंटू सिक्स इज इक्वल टू थर्टी सिक्स थर्टी सिक्स करेक्ट ऑप्शन दट इज ऑप्शन सी तो दिस क्वेश्चन वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस्ड वेरी इलेबोरेटली जस्ट टू और थ्री क्वेश्चन बैक दैट्स वाई आई एम नॉट टेकिंग दैट मच टाइम इन दिस क्वेश्चन बिकॉज वी हैव ऑलरेडी डन दिस क्वेश्चन ठीक है सो यू वॉन्ट टू नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन ओके सो अगेन दिस क्वेश्चन वॉज आस्ट इन द ईयर ट्वेंटी फिफ्टीन ये फिगर दिया है टू फिट द क्वेश्चन मार्क इन द प्लेस ऑफ क्वेश्चन मार्क वी नीड टू फिल समथिंग अच्छा नाउ यू सी दिस सर्कल इज डार्क दिस सर्कल इज इट इज इट इज हैविंग नो कलर एंड इट इज आल्सो शेलो ठीक नाउ इफ आई सी फर्स्ट आई सी ट्रायंगल तो ट्रायंगल इज फर्स्ट हियर देन इट इज हियर बट इट इट इज रोटेटेड देन इट इज कमिंग हियर बट अगेन इट इज रोटेटेड then it is coming here then again it is rotated and then it is it should become here so that is this triangle is following a clockwise approach like here then here then again here then again here so from here this triangle will go again upwards and this triangle is getting rotated every time 180 degree this like this fir rotate kar gaya fir rotate kar gaya so again this triangle will be at the upper side and this will be one line theek okay. and this ठीक है नाउ इफ आई सी दिस इफ आई फोकस ऑन दिस रेक्टेंगल फर्स्ट इट इज हियर देन इट इज गेटिंग हियर इट इज हियर दिस ब्लैक सर्कल इज हियर नाउ दिस ब्लैक सर्कल इन द नेक्स्ट केस इज डाउन दिस पोर्शन इज कमिंग हियर एंड दिस हॉलो शेप इज गेटिंग हियर हियर दिस अगेन दिस ब्लैक it is coming here this hollow circle is coming here and this hollow this square or rectangle whatever is given is again rotating like this so this is following a anti clockwise approach like this here also this is coming here this is coming here this is coming here so in this case also this will come here that means here it would be some hollow this black one will come here that is dark and this is come here so the correct option would be 
नीचे हो ब्लैक होना चाहिए तो आइडर दिस और दिस ऑप्शन बस दिस एंगल इज अपवर्ड्स दिस इज करेक्ट करेक्ट नाइस सो नाउ आई सी द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन फोर कार्डबीट कार्डबोर्ड पीसेस ऑफ स्पेसिफिक शेप्स आर शोन इन द फॉलोइंग फिगर विच वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग फिगर्स केवन कैन बी फॉर्म्ड बाय ज्वाइनिंग These pieces together. So basically ये बोल रहा है इन पीसेस को मैं एड करूं तो इनमें से कौन सा फिगर बन सकता है बेसिकली इट इज आस्किंग इन दीज फोर फिगर इन विच ऑफ द फिगर दीज फोर डिफरेंट पीसेस आर इम्बेडेड इज इम्बेडेड अगर मैं इसको देखू दीज टू आर स्ट्रेट तो स्ट्रेट तो है नहीं यहां पर These two are straight, but this line is somewhat. अब इसको ऐसे घुमा दें बट वेर विल बी दीज पीसेस सो इफ दीज इफ दीज आर दो पीसेस तो देन स्पेस फॉर दीज विल नॉट बी लीव लेफ्ट इफ दीज आर दीस पीसेस But here, this will this will not be tilted. If this is straight, then this figure is possible. So this is also not right. So if we see this, so these if I stick these and rotate like this, so yes, this is one, and this is rotated. Now if see this figure, so this is like this formed, very nice, and this is like this. So if this height, is go by as I rotate, kar do. So this and this. So the correct option would be option D. You can see. All different four pieces are embedded here. You can, if you join these four, then you can make like this. How how it is formed? In two pieces, you have stuck it and like this. So this is like this. Then what have you done? This one has rotated like this. This one has rotated like this. So it would be something like that. But this one has rotated like this. 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 This one has rotated ऐसा कोई फिगर बन रहा है यस तो दिस इज द फिगर दिस इज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन तो दीज आर वेरी सिंपल क्वेश्चन जो फिगर वाले क्वेश्चन होते हैं कि व्हाट वुड बी इन द नेक्स्ट फिगर व्हाट वुड बी इन द नेक्स्ट फिगर दोज क्वेश्चन आर रियली रियली वेरी इजी क्वेश्चन ठीक है नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन एग्जाम इन द फॉलोइंग फिगर विच वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग फिगर हैज द एब फिगर इम्बेडेड इसको अगर मैं देखूं आपका ये फिगर इनमें से किस में इंबेडेड है द फिगर इज दिस ऐसा कुछ है ठीक है ऐसा कुछ इंबेडेड है तो अब अगर मैं इस फिगर को देखूं इसमें नीचे का लोअर पोर्शन है बट अपर पोर्शन इज रिवर्स्ड तो रिवर्स भी करेंगे तो ये लाइन एंड दिस लाइन इज गेटिंग एक्स्ट्रा ये गलत हो गया दिस फिगर व्हाट इज दिस फिगर यार कहां पे है वेर वेर इज दिस पोर्शन दिस पोर्शन इज नॉट अवेलेबल नो दिस इज आल्सो रॉन्ग इफ आई सी दिस ऑप्शन तो दिस ये पोर्शन तो मतलब ये पोर्शन मुझे मिल गया अब अगर इसको मैं ऐसे जाऊं तो ये पोर्शन भी मुझे मिल गया यहां तक मिल गया मुझे ठीक है एंड देन इफ दिस इज द लाइन देन दिस पोर्शन इज ऑल्सो गेटिंग हियर सो दिस इज इम्बेडेड दिस 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 सो आई गॉट दिस माई फिगर वॉट इज द इम्बेडेड फिगर हियर Can see this, 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 and this. Can see this is my embedded figure, right? यहाँ पे कहीं भी ऐसा embedded नहीं मिल रहा है. Extra है भी, but that is not making the, you know, part of this figure. Here it is embedded. So this is option C. And obviously यहाँ पे है और यहाँ पे तो वैसे भी नहीं दिख रहा है. 
this base this line is there this line is also there then it should be something like that something like that a but that sh there should be some straight line the straight line is not given here so this is also not right so this is the correct option because it the figure is get embedded in this given figure okay so now we'll move on to next question this is question number 14 this was asked in the year 2014 so what is asking you know diagram diya hai which one of the following figures fits into the blank part of the above metric theek hai ab main agar first row ko dekhu dhyan se you can see this first row first arrow isko aise hi chhod diya isko reverse kar diya in the second part this arrow is as it is but this arrow has been reversed are you getting what I am trying to convey? Are you getting what I am trying to convey? कि यार इसमें क्या किया? जो second वाला box है इसमें first वाले arrow को as it is रहने दिया, इसको reverse कर दिया. Second वाले में second वाले को as it is रहने दिया and इसको reverse कर दिया, right? Again second वाले में you can see first arrow was as it is, इसको they reversed. In the third box, isko aise hi rehne diya, arrow, isko reverse kar diya. So in the second figure, what I'll do, isko mein as it is rehne dunga, aur isko kya karo, isko aise reverse kiya hai, ye as it is hai, ye as it is hai, isko mein reverse kar dunga. Ye as it is hai, isko reverse kar diya, ye as it is hai, isko reverse kar diya. Is there any option like this? This option B. So these are very simple questions, these are cake walks for you. This is a cake walk. It's a simple hai hi question. You just need to see and within 5 seconds, 10 seconds, you can you know mark the option. But you need not to be very enthusiastic. Here, you know what's simple. You need to give 5 seconds extra to such simple questions. Simple question may be mistake. Hoti hai. So simple question is not time. Dena hai. 5 seconds jar chale jai. But that would be a sure short question of yours. Just say you know. Okay. Next. Okay. So in this question, consider the following matrix with one empty blocks in the lower extreme corner. Very nice. 2014 में ये पूछा गया है। अब मुझे क्या करना है? Which of the following could empty block? मतलब यहाँ पे क्या fill करना है? यही तो है। This is the empty block. Now if I see, I'll see the circle first. There are four, three, two, four circles, three circles, two circles, three circles, two circles, one. So every circle is getting reduced by one number. Three, two, one. Four, three, two. Here it is two. Here it is one. Then there will be two, one. There will be zero circles. So there will not be any circles. So here it will be zero circles. Very good. Now if I see triangle, two triangles, three triangles, four triangles. Number of triangles is getting increased. Two, three, four. Number of triangles, one, two, three. Number of triangles is getting increased. Then here it is one. Then here it must be one, two, three. Here it is, but it is, there is no triangle, zero triangle one triangle then there here must be two triangles zero triangle one triangle two triangles one triangle two triangle three, three triangle two triangle three triangle four triangle so that is the shape where zero circle and two triangles so in all the other options circles are given here it is zero circle and two triangles that is the, our correct option that is option a is correct if you see the pattern quite out is my quite out thing next question with reference to the figure given below the number of different routes from s to t without retracing from u and or v is actually this is a question of routes and network as well as well as non-verbal reasoning but we have taken this in this non-verbal reasoning so we will solve it here only kya karna hai isme hame kya karna hai s to t jana hai Without retracing from u, ऐसा नहीं कि u से फिर हम घूम गए, v से घूम के फिर से आ गए, ऐसा नहीं। एक बार में जाना है। S to t there are how many ways? So let's say हमने s s से हमने चले and we have taken this upper route, this u u पहुँचे, u से again we have taken this upper route, v पहुँचे and then v से we can go to t either by this way or by this way or by this way. 
दिस इज फर्स्ट सेकेंड थर्ड दिस इज टी आर यू गेटिंग यहां से ऐसे ऐसे एंड हियर आई कैन टेक आइदर दिस रूट सो आई कैन गो थ्रू आइदर दिस रूट टू टी और आई कैन गो to this root or i can go through this root so there are three routes possible if i take this root if i go from s to u taking this straight way s to u this is straight way hai na and then i take that upper v right s to u straight v and there again you can take three ways 1 2 3 2 t so there are three more ways i have taken this straight root then this top root 1 2 3 now i take this bottom root s se u u se then again i take that bottom this upper 1 then again there are three ways to go to t 1 2 3 if i take this root this 1 2 3 so these are three ways now if i see i have i take s again like this and now i take u as this because okay, we have covered all these upper roots now you can also go we, we can take this bottom wala root so this is u this is s this is v and then again i can take three roots 1 2 3 there are three such roots this is t then again s u again i can take this bottom root and here i can take एस आई कैन टेक दैट इज स्ट्रेट रूट यू यहां पर मैं बॉटम वाला रूट ले लिया यू वी एंड देन अगेन आई कैन टेक थ्री रूट टू टी वन टू थ्री थ्री रूट अगेन एंड द लास्ट वन विल बी जहां पर मैं एस से बॉटम में चला जाऊं एस यू अगेन आई टेक द बॉटम रूट टू वी एंड देन आई हैव थ्री रूट टू टी वन टू थ्री एस यू वी थ्री सो अगेन थ्री रूट सो देर आर टोटल हाउ मेनी रूट One, two, three, four, five, six, six into three. That is eighteen roots possible. So the correct option would be option D, eighteen roots. Any doubt? कुछ भी doubt है इसमें? बस इसमें क्या है? Systematic approach follow करनी है. S to T जाना है. So first I will take this root. Bottom root को मैंने ignore किया. This, this, and here I can go either by this, this, this. This is three roots. then i have ignored this this here i am taking this first upper wala root s se teen teen different tarike jane ke then i have taken this u ka bottom wala root and here i can take this 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 like this so these will be total 18 number of ways through which i can go from s to t any doubt here okay so now i will see the next question This question was again asked in the year 2014. Change in the position of beats in the four figures of a follower sort sequence following the same sequence, which of the figures below should appear as the fifth figure again? So now, if we, if I see, it how is it changing? In the first or second figure, mein. this left wala box here, hai. then this left box comes here, this box comes here. That means this goes here, this goes here. this upper filled portion is coming at the bottom this lower port filled portion coming at the top so again this is getting followed in the first one and two ye niche gaya ye upar gaya ye niche gaya ye upar gaya now if i see this two and three this rightmost portion is gone here and this half filled portion bottom wala is gone here that is like this like this this upper filled portion is gone here it is here This left portion is gone here. Here, ठीक है. अब इसमें और इसमें देखें. So again, this half filled portion is gone here. This is gone here. Again, this is followed. This right portion is gone here. Left portion is gone here. Again, this is. So again. For this, this pattern will be followed. That is, this will go here, this will go here, this will go here, this will go here. So if I make like this, this, this is going here. 
this one this is going here upper portion then this is going here then this is going here so is there any option like this where here it is left here it is right no left right left wrong left right so this is the option correct b option b is the correct option here left right and here is this top and bottom top and bottom this is the pattern getting followed any doubt you just need to check you need to be very focused ki kya hai these are very easy questions very very easy kuch bhi hai isme beats dekha aapne wo pattern change kar diya theek hai okay so this is the next question question number 18 these are the problem figures and now it is it will be asked the next figure next figure kaun sa ho sakta hai isme theek hai so if i see if i see this arrow here it is down up down up so then definitely it would be down here something like that now this plus sign it is getting this sign is getting here then it is getting here then it is getting here that is it is taking a clockwise movement here then here then here then here and definitely it would be move to here and it would be some something like that also wherever this sign is not at the top then this triangle is tilted towards this sign and this sign is a cross sign where when it is not at the top so then this sign will be cross sign and this triangle will be tilted towards this sign so any option like this triangle with yes this is tilted here and this is a cross sign then this option c is correct any doubt here kuch bhi nahi hai simple hai aapne bas uska pattern dekh liya ye pattern kaise follow kar raha hai theek hai now we will move on to the next question so this is a figure कैसे बनाया है ठीक है this triangle now if i see this triangle this triangle is getting here then here then here then here that is this triangle is taking this route of anti clockwise this triangle here then on this box then this box then then this box here then here then here then here this is the final so then the last would be here so the triangle will come here and now if i see this sun sun is taking a also an anti clockwise approach here then here then here then here so here and this is rotating inside this square so this will again come here so triangle will be coming here this sun will be coming here so is there any option where triangle is here sun is here. yes option b is correct any doubt in this question kuch bhi nahi hai kya hai isme we you know we uh, tried to see the pattern followed by triangle as well as this sun aur wo humne kar liya to we got the pattern next so again they are asking the next figure ki kya hoga this is a circle theek hai now if i see this is a pattern given then they did something to this and they here i think they have changed this arrow so what i can do i can relate one thing ki this first and this fourth they are you know the fourth one is reversed portion of first isko agar maine reverse kar do so this line will be coming this will be coming it would be the रिवर्स ऑफ दिस इसको ऐसे रिवर्स कर दो राइट बहुत बढ़िया 
सो फर्स्ट वाले का रिवर्स फोर्थ है एंड सेकेंड एंड थर्ड को इफ आई सी हियर इट इज सेम इट इज सेम बट ओनली डिफरेंस इज दिस इज सेम दिस इज ऑल्सो सेम द ओनली डिफरेंस इज द एरो विच वॉज एट द स्टार्टिंग दिस कम्स एट द एंड एंड दैट इज इन द रिवर्स फॉर्म ठीक है दैट इज द थिंग नाउ इफ इफ आई टेक दिस थ्री टूगेदर तो दिस फर्स्ट वाले को रिवर्स करा था फोर मिला था अब इन द फिफ्थ फिगर वॉट आई विल डू आई विल डू आई विल रिवर्स दिस फिगर आई विल रिवर्स दिस फिगर देन ओनली द पैटर्न विल बी गेटिंग फॉलोड एनी प्रॉब्लम इज एनी प्रॉब्लम सो इफ आई रिवर्स यू फर्स्ट का रिवर्स फोर है तो सेकेंड का रिवर्स फिफ्थ होगा तो इसको अगर मैं रिवर्स करूं so this arrow will be getting reversed like this this will be like this and this will be like this so any option like this mm, this is not uh, option b any doubt you can see first ko reverse kiya to fourth mila to so second ko reverse karenge to fifth milega third ko reverse karenge to sixth mil jayega like this so this pattern is getting followed here Any doubt? कोई डाउट की बात ही नहीं है इसमें है ना सो वील मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन कंसिडर द फॉलोइंग फिगर्स विच इज लॉजिकली कमिंग सेवेंथ पोजिशन इंडिकेटेड अब क्वेश्चन मार्क तो अब फिर सेवेंथ पता करना है तो इफ आई सी I will make one big circle. Big circle तो बनाइए seventh में. Here this is circle square, circle square, alternate circle square, circle square, circle square. Then it would be a circle. So obviously square वाले option तो eliminate हो गए. एक ही option था. ठीक है. Here you see this is clockwise. Here you see this is anti-clockwise. It is clockwise. Here it is anti-clockwise. Clockwise. एंटी क्लॉक वाइज हियर यू सी टू आर क्लॉक वाइज नहीं टू इज एंटी क्लॉक वाइज वन इज क्लॉक वाइज और यू बल टू सी दिस इज क्लॉक वाइज दिस टू आर एंटी क्लॉक वाइज हियर ऑल आर एंटी क्लॉक वाइज ऑल आर क्लॉक वाइज हियर इफ यू सी अगेन ऑल आर क्लॉक वाइज clockwise 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 all are anti clockwise here again if you see these two are anti clockwise one is clockwise so are you getting any pattern clockwise anti clockwise clockwise plus two anti clockwise clockwise anti clockwise clockwise plus two anti clockwise that means after every three the same pattern is getting followed of arrows so clockwise anti clockwise clockwise plus anti clockwise clockwise anti clockwise clockwise plus anti clockwise then again it will be coming after this clockwise so all the arrow will be of clockwise so is there any figure like this so this is anti clockwise this is wrong this is clockwise plus anti clockwise this is also wrong so this is correct because all these are clockwise so the correct option would be option d which is clockwise koi doubt isme simple tha हमने सर्कल वाला देख लिया कि सर्कल बनेगा स्क्वायर बनेगा एक एलिमिनेट कर लिया एंड देन आई हैव सीन द डायरेक्शन ऑफ एरोस ठीक नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन द एलिमेंट्स ऑफ द प्रॉब्लम फिगर्स गिवन बिलो आर चेंजिंग विद अ सर्टेन रूल एज वी ऑब्जर्व देम फ्रॉम लेफ्ट टू राइट ठीक है अब इसका मुझे पता करना है कि भाई क्या होगा नाउ इफ आई सी इफ आई सी दिस ट्रायंगल सो आई विल मेक दिस नेक्स्ट फिगर पूछ रहा है राइट सो हियर वुड बी नेक्स्ट फिगर दिस इज ट्रैंगल देन दिस ट्रैंगल इज कमिंग हियर देन दिस ट्रैंगल इज कमिंग हियर देन दिस ट्रैंगल इज कमिंग दैट इज दिस ट्रैंगल इज कमिंग हियर देन दिस वुड्स कमिंग देयर दिस इज कमिंग देयर देन दिस शुड बी कमिंग हियर लाइक दिस इट इज फॉलोइंग अ एंटी क्लॉकवाइज अप्रोच राइट नाउ दिस ट्रैंगल इज गेटिंग रिवर्सड एवरी टाइम रिवर्स देन अगेन रिवर्स देन अगेन रिवर्स सो अगेन हियर इट विल बी रिवर्सड ठीक है नाउ इफ आई सी दिस एरो दिस लाइन फर्स्ट इट इज हियर एंड इट इज समवॉट टिल्टेड 
then again it is tilted like this again it is tilted like this then again it will be further tilted like this है ना देखो ना आप थोड़ा सा ऐसे मूव किया तो ये आ गए इसको फर्दर मूव किया तो इट इज फिर इसको अगर फिर फर्दर मूव किया तो इट इज अगेन बिकेम लाइक दिस सो अगेन इफ आई फर्दर मूव लाइक दिस इन दिस डायरेक्शन इन एंटी क्लॉक वाइज डायरेक्शन देन दिस विल बिकम लाइक दिस समवॉट लाइक दिस तो अपर ट्रायंगल तो अपर ट्रायंगल तो केवल एक ही ऑप्शन में दिया है एंड देयर लाइन इज लाइक दिस सो दिस इज करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज ऑप्शन डी कोई डाउट इसमें नहीं कुछ भी नहीं है सिंपल पैटर्न देखना है पैटर्न देखना इज नॉट एट ऑल डिफिकल्ट सो दिस फिगर काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चंस दे बिकम वेरी इजी सो यू शुड इफ दिस काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चंस कम यू शुड इंश्योर दैट नन ऑफ द क्वेश्चंस शुड बी रॉन्ग ठीक है नाउ इफ आई विल सी दिस क्वेश्चन दिस क्वेश्चन वाज आस्क्ड इन द ईयर 2012 सो व्हाट इज दिस क्वेश्चन Zero. Which one of the figures shown below occupies the blank space? So, if I see this, here, this is the this is a circle which is divided into four parts. So, this first part is shaded, then opposite part is shaded, then again this part is shaded. That is like this, and then this. ये इसका opposite, then इसका opposite. So, that means इसके opposite वाले में ये आएगा. If this is the circle. this is the four parts if this part is shaded so in the next this opposite part would be shaded that is this part would be shaded and in the third this ka opposite that is this part will be shaded that is right and here also you can see the same pattern is getting followed this ka opposite shaded then this ka opposite shaded so this would be the correct option is me this fourth sector is shaded so is there any option yes option d this fourth part is shaded these are very simple questions you know बस केक वॉक है देखो टिक करो देखो टिक करो आगे बढ़ो टिक करो आगे बढ़ो टिक करो आगे बढ़ो दिस काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन द जनरली डोंट कम दिस डेज बट इफ एनी क्वेश्चन बिकॉज दिस इज अ वेरी ओल्ड क्वेश्चन ऑफ ट्वेंटी ट्वेल्व बट इफ इफ एनी एनी ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन कम तब आपको ये सही ही करना है बिकॉज कोई चॉइस नहीं है तब गलत करने का नाउ इफ आई सी दिस क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी फोर सो दिस क्वेश्चन इज Consider the following figure and answer the item that follow. What is the total number of triangles in the above grid? Again, same kind of question. Number of triangles गिनना ये जिस पे गिनना होता है ना that is a very confusing task. कई बार आप miss कर जाते हो कई बार आप double add कर जाते हो. So that means you have to be very vigil. So I have told you the systematic approach. जैसे मैंने वो dotted और solid वाले में था what I have done. I have calculated the number of solid triangles. नंबर ऑफ डॉटेड ट्रेंगल्स एंड कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ बोथ पहले लोग नाम में वन बॉक्स से बने हुए टू बॉक्स से बने हुए थ्री बॉक्स से बने हुए सो हियर आल्सो आई वुड यूज सिमिलर काइंड ऑफ अप्रोच वेयर आई वुड काउंट द ट्रेंगल्स विद ओनली वन वन पोर्शन लेट से means one portion means this part this part this part only one part one part hai na 1 2 3 4 4 similar parts given over so how many such triangles then triangle with two portion hai na triangle with three portion and then triangle with four portion pura hi jo bana hoga वन टू थ्री फोर तो इफ आई काउंट नंबर विथ वन पोर्शन वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन इलेवन ट्वेल्व थर्टीन फोर्टीन फोर्टीन नहीं है बिकॉज दीज टू आर नॉट ट्रेंगल्स टू ट्वेल्व वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन इलेवन ट्वेल्व देर आर ट्वेल्व सच ट्रेंगल्स any doubt then triangle with two so if i take this color triangle with two portion two se dekho aap so this is one two three four five 
सिक्स इज इट ओवर इज इट ओवर ओनली सिक्स नो यू हैव मिस दिस ट्रेंगल दिस इज ऑल्सो अ ट्रेंगल विद ओनली टू पोर्शन वन एंड टू तो टोटल सेवन सच ट्रेंगल्स वेरी नाइस हमने सेवन ये काउंट कर लिए अब ट्रेंगल विथ थ्री यूनिट्स थ्री यूनिट्स दिस ट्रेंगल वन देन दिस ट्रेंगल टू देन दिस ट्रेंगल थ्री इसमें रिवर्स वाला तो ऐसा कोई ऑप्शन नहीं है वन टू थ्री थ्री सच ट्रेंगल्स एंड ट्रेंगल विद फोर तो फोर तो एक ही है इस वन टू थ्री फोर फोर यूनिट मतलब वन टू थ्री फोर फोर इज वन Then how many total number will be? Twelve. Total will be twelve plus seven plus three plus one. That is twenty-three. So twenty-three such triangles are possible here. So this is also option correct. See. How I am so sure that twenty-three is correct? Because I have adopted a systematic approach. कि भाई only one portion से कितने बन रहे हैं, two portion से कितने बन रहे हैं, and while I am counting. From two portion or three portion or one portion, then I am very vigilant. कि यार कोई छूट तो नहीं रहा है. Two portion में this triangle, ये वाला जो triangle है, this was the possibility कि मैं इसको भूल जाऊँ. But I was vigilant, I was focused. कि नहीं नहीं, I was attentive. कि नहीं यार ये भूलना नहीं. अगर मैं एक भूल जाता तो twenty three का twenty two हो जाता. And they have given the option. UPSC has given the option कि आप mistake करो. They want कि आप यहाँ पे mistake करोगे. है ना? So if you will adopt a systematic approach and you will practice these questions again and again of you know counting the number of triangles or parallelograms, then this would be very easy for you to to take the systematic approach. चलिए next question. This question is asked in the year 2011. Consider the given figure, figure given below, and answer the item that follow. In the figure shown above, OP1 and OP2 are two plane mirrors kept perpendicular to each other. So these are two plane mirrors which are perpendicular. Very nice. S is the direction of a beam. ये एक direction of beam है. Falling on the perpendicular to each other. ऐसे डाल सकते हो लोग फ्लाइट. Falling on the mirror OP1. ठीक है. The direction of the reflected beam of light from the mirror OP2. OP2 से reflected beam beam का कितना होगा? So if this is the mirror O, sorry, P2 O P1. If this is S, so आपने पता होगा जब भी beam किसी mirror पर, you know it टकराती है किसी mirror पे, then what what happens? It reflects in the direction of 90 degree. तो यहाँ से ये beam आई, and from here this will take a 90 degree turn from here. This angle will be 90 degree to this mirror. Now this will be the direction. But this is again a beam. Even though this is a reflected beam, so again this will take a 90 degree turn from this mirror. Something like that. So this angle is again 90 degree. Now you see whether this beam or this beam, what is what is the relationship between these two beams? So if I proceed this line. You can see this angle is also 90, this is 90, this hole is 180, and then this is 90 degree. If you see this angle, this angle and this angle, these angles are corresponding angles. There are two lines, in between there is one intersecting line and these two angles. When these two are corresponding angles, that is angles are same, that means this line and this line is parallel to each other. From the figure also you can see 90, line again 90, so these two are parallel. So the correct option will be direction of the reflected beam of light will be perpendicular to direction S. No, it is parallel. This is wrong. At 45 to the direction S. No, 45 is not parallel. Is. This is wrong. Opposite and parallel to the direction S. Yes, S is incident. Pe. This is getting in this direction. So opposite and parallel. So this option is correct. At 60 degrees is wrong. So this is the correct option. Any doubt here? कुछ भी नहीं है बस आपको ये बताना चाहिए कि 90 पे आएगा दिस इज करेस्पोंडिंग एंगल वो करेस्पोंडिंग है तो पैरेलल होगी अदरवाइज यू कैन सी आल्सो फ्रॉम द फिगर कि दिस इज 90 दिस इज अगेन दिस इज द कॉमन लाइन एंड दिस इज अगेन 90 सो डेफिनेटली दिस विल बी टू पैरेलल लाइंस एंड द डायरेक्शन विल बी अपोजिट राइट 
so we will move on to the next question okay so in this question they have asked this was asked in the year 2011 consider the following figure and answer the item that follows what is the minimum number of different colors required to paint the figure given above such that no two adjacent regions have the same color minimum number of different colors required to paint the figure given below such that no two adjacent regions have the same color so let's say many color lilia red or green first one a color lilia let's say only one color is required so if i if this is red if this is red then definitely this whole portion cannot be red so definitely this must be a different color let's say this is green theek hai ab ek baar batao ye red hai ye green hai so if this is green and i want to use only two colors then this might be red so green and red no problem because no adjacent surfaces should be having same color so if this whole is green and if this is red this is okay but here ye batao this color cannot be red because this will be adjacent to this and this color cannot also be green because this whole portion is green so these two will be adjacent faces so definitely i need to bring a new color let's say i bought pink so if this color is pink for example then this is okay because this is green this is pink this is red again this is red if i use only these three colors red pink red green no option red pink red pink so you can see red pink red pink red pink red pink red pink no two adjacent faces have the same color and here it is green and here it is red again in these portions we use two colors red and pink so definitely we cannot use red and pink here so let's see we will again use green here in this whole portion we use green here so again those these two adjacent faces are not having similar color if i am using green here then again i cannot use green here so i can use red or pink again similar pattern red pink red pink red pink so that these two adjacent faces are not having same color and also there is no color green so these two adjacent faces will not also be having same color so minimum number of color we are going to use in this figure is three that is option a this is somewhat analytical question maine pehle socha ki minimum ek se hi karta hu ek se hua nahi then i tried two colors so i tried a red green red yahan tak to sab sahi tha but when i moved here then i thought no 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 two colors will not be sufficient then i introduced third color but when i used third color and i you know filled the figure with colors then i saw ki yaar ab to teen figure teen color se kaam hamara ho gaya hai that means only minimum three colors are required to fill this figure when there are no two adjacent faces have same color oh theek hai so next question okay so now we have covered all the questions of this topic non verbal reasoning from the year 2022 to 11 i would recommend you to watch my video first and then try to solve these questions again on your own especially counting of number of triangles number of parallelograms jo maine aapko formulas ek do baar bataye the unko bhi yaad kar lo and <clears throat> remember when to use these formulas directly but focus more on the understanding of the question rather than more or less on formula because in the exam they might give you you know some tricky question kuch ghuma ke de sakte hain otherwise if you know the concept then i think you don't you will not be feeling any difficulty if you face any problem in solving these questions again please let us know we are always here to help you out till then all the very best study hard work hard and thank you so much for watching my video thanks